I just like a kid in a candy store. Uh, it's just, I mean, this place. Good morning. So this morning we've uh, come to somewhere completely different, somewhere I've been trying to get to for a long time, just never got around to it. Um, but I've got a few days off work, so uh, I thought I'd give it a go. So we've come to Frampton Marsh, uh, a place I've heard a lot about. Um, I mean, even just driving in on the, on the road in, there was uh, four or five roe deer trotting across the field. Uh, I saw a hawk of some sort in the distance hovering. As I've pulled up in the car park, there's a kestrel up in the tree. So uh, yeah, um, really hoping it's gonna be a good day. Uh, not sure about the weather. Um, sunshine showers forecast so we'll see what happens um, but hopefully it's going to hold off pretty well for us um, big debate which coat to put on do I put on a real big waterproof or do I put on this one um, don't know you might see me change on the way around um, but yeah let's go and have a walk around and let's see what we can find Well, I have to say, I've got about, I don't know, 20 yards from the uh, visitor centre at the moment. I just, I just like a kid in a candy store. Uh, it's just, I mean, this place, I mean, I've gone nowhere yet. And there's just so much going on around here, you know, so much stuff out here. I'm really going to have to try and focus because it's going to be really hard otherwise. Um, but yeah, yeah, I'm really looking forward to this. So let's go and see what else we can find.
people have told me that Frampton is a, is a great place to come to. Um, and I can see why. I mean, you know, I don't know which way to look. There's so much going on. It's just really hard to concentrate. You know, when you're trying to vlog and take photos and, and things are flying at you from all angles, it's really difficult. You know, you don't know what to do. Um, I'm not the only one sitting in the hide here, hence why I haven't got my mask on, because I do ask you to put masks on during the, in the hides. I've got it here ready, but um, if I need it, so... Uh, but, yeah, what an amazing place. I mean, I've I hardly got anywhere, and, you know, we're in a good couple of hours in now, I guess. Um, I think... I'm going to have to have a couple of visits here because I'm just, you're just not going to see them. But you've got to focus, I think, on one area. So I think we're going to focus on the hides initially. I'd like to get down to the wash itself and go and have a look. Um, but uh, I think we'll just have to see how that goes. Um, but let's focus on the hides to start off with and see what we can find around here. Let's see if we can get some photos because I, I need to start concentrating and get some pictures, I think. So let's see what we can do. You know, I have a bad feeling about my photography today. <sighs> I don't know which way to look, I don't know what to do. I mean, I, I guess it's a bit of a scouting mission really, but uh, I can see me coming away without any photos where I'm going, because I'm just so enthralled by the place. It's so vast, um, there's so much going on. Um, yeah. It's, it, it's, I mean, it's much bigger than I expected, totally unexpected, really. Um, and as I say, there, there just seems to be so much going on around the place. The sun's coming out now, so it's, it's quite nice. Um, although that means the light might get a bit harsh. Um, but, yeah, absolutely amazing, you know, as I say. I really need to go and focus on getting a few photos, because otherwise I'm not going to have anything. Um, and that's what I've come here for. I've come here to take photos, so I've really got to do that.